Hello, I'm Adam McCarthy and welcome to the SSA's Athletics Best Track Performances of 2022. If you can hit subscribe, that would really help this channel out. Or alternatively, you may want to look at our Facebook pages, both the training page as well as the club page or even the club website. We will be having an Instagram page coming soon. Now, Note, so in order to get onto this particular list, you have to be doing a senior performance at a senior level, and that it has to be televised in some way or another. So Botswana's Let Silly Tebogo in the California World Athletic Championships for the under 20s, who broke the age group world record, doesn't count. So our first performance at number 10, Devin Allen going to number three all time in New York. In his final year of track and field before embarking on a career in the NFL and that fateful time he got disqualified or not disqualified from the World Championships depending on how you perceive it, Devin Allen produced the best run of his life to win at the Continental Tour Gold Meeting in New York in a clash with the world champion Grant Holloway. Allen won the 110 meter hurdles in 1284 moving him to third on the world all-time list, just 0.04 shy of the world record. At number nine, we have Jake Whiteman in Oregon. The winner is my son. Those were the immortal lines from stadium announcer Jeff Whiteman, stated as Jake Whiteman crossed the line. Jake Whiteman was always amazing talent and racer, but never thought to be a medal contender. The favorite coming into the world was another young talent, Norwegian Inga Britson, who was the best in Europe, and the world coming into the champs. Inga Britson hit the front early, dragging Whiteman and a Kenyan with him. Whiteman then took the lead only for Jacob to retake the front. Whiteman then took the front again on the last lap. This caused Jacob to slow down as he was caught on the inside on the back straight. He was never able to recover as they sprinted down the home straight. As a result of this surprise win, Jake Whiteman wins SSA's shock performance of 2022 stamp on approval. At number eight, and talking about Jakob Inge Blitzen, we talk about Jakob Inge Blitzen at the Europeans completes the double-double by winning the 2022 European 1500 meter title. After claiming the 5000 meter goal in the European Athletics Championships, Jakob Inge Blitzen set his sights on the 1500 meter final. In wire-to-wire -wire fashion, he was able to set a championship record of 3.32.76. Coming in at number seven, Kimberly Garcia winning a historical race walking double. With the Russians out of these championships, the Chinese looked to sweep the much longer distances. However, Kimberly Garcia had other plans. Few would have predicted that the Peruvian race walker would win a world title in Oregon and even fewer would have had her down to complete the race walk double. But the 28-year-old did exactly that, winning gold over the 20k and 35 km, and earning her country's first ever world title in the process. Number six, best performance. Good after Seagay was having a one-woman season in an attempt to break her own record. She was in the ballpark all to herself. In to run in Poland, she was able to run a time that was only a second off her own world record to make her arguably one of the best indoor athletes over the distance ever. Five gold rings at number five we have Faith the Sniper Kip Yagon winning the world title in Oregon. In a race where there was only three contenders, Great Britain's Laura Muir, Tasige of Ethiopia and Kip Yagon. She won it from start to finish before pulling away on the last leg. To win a race leading it from the start is almost unheard of in elite athletics because everyone has a kick of some sort. Therefore, you're effectively giving them permission to overtake you and to use less energy. So what she did was incredibly brave, coming to the front and dominating the race from a very early stage. At number dreaded four, we have Wigless Fraser Price winning in style. There were several highlights in Shelley Ann Fraser Price's season, not least her fifth world 100 meter title in Oregon, but the last big well moment of 2022 for the Jamaican sprinter came in Z the Diamond League Zurich meeting where she won in the 10.68, what became a record 7 sub 1070 
clockings that year. In the bronze medal position at number three, I have Sydney McLaughlin. World records really are my favourite food. Sydney McLaughlin has been absolutely devastating the world record as of recent years. What will surely go down as one of the greatest athletics performances in history, Sydney McLaughlin smashed her own already sensational world record to win the 400 metre hurdles on home soil in Oregon. A winning time of 50.68, competitive in most international flat races, let alone the hurdles. Unbelievable! She's unbeatable, she shakes her head as if to say, maybe even I didn't think I could do that. What was even more amazing, she seemed so surprised that she was able to do that. At the silver medal position at number two, Eliab Kipchoge's historic Berlin Marathon world record. In this marathon, he was able to break the world record and get close to legal two hour barrier. Eliab Kipchoge, who was heavily helped out by his specific pacemakers that he trains with, as well as having his own water boys that helped him on each station to relay information, was able to run exceedingly quick. At one point, he was almost trying to race in the pacemakers, asking them to go faster. Eliab Kipchoge has already cemented himself as the greatest all time at marathon running, but with this it just puts another notch onto that record. But now it's time for something that you can do amazing, and that amazing thing is boop that like button, hit subscribe, or even check out our Facebook pages, or even the club. By the way guys, we do have an athletics club, many of you probably wouldn't realise that. If you're in the South End area, why not come and check it out? A quick roundup of best performances 2023. At number 10, we had Devin Allen. At number 9, we had Jake Whiteman at the Oregon. At number 8, we had Jacob Inbillickson winning the double. Kimberly Garcia winning a world double. Good after Seagay nearly breaking a world record. Faith Kip Yegon. Chilean Fraser Price, 7 is a magic number and a very lucky one. Sydney McLaughlin with that amazing 400 meter hurdle run. And Eliab Kipchoge breaking the marathon world record. And finally, we have for our best performance of 2023 is Toby Amazon. If you told a pundit or an expert that Toby Amazon was going to win the 100 meter hurdles in Oregon World Championships, they would have said probably close but no Sagai. Lucky if she gets to the final. If I was to tell you that she was to break the world record and do it, they would probably slap you around the face with a salmon. At first, many questioned the timing system. Could someone really break the world record by that much in a semi-final? But it soon became apparent that Nigerian Toby Amazon running a 12.12 .12 in the 100 meter hurdles at the World Championship was legitimate as she went even quicker in the final with a wind assisted 12.06. Pulling away over the third and fourth hurdle, there was no one who was able to keep with her rhythm, technique, and sheer speed. Now some for some honourable mention, Sofany El Bacali. Now to be honest with you, I was gonna stick this in up until the last draft because everyone kept banging on about Faith Kip Yegon and Good of Tsege, so I put them above this guy. It was either them two or him. But in Oregon over the steeplechase, it was very difficult because of a nutter standing in lane one. No one really wanted to push it. And then on the final lap, we had the most insane lap, people pushing on everywhere, people stacking it. And he was able to keep out of trouble to win the race. The Not necessarily the fastest performance gets on these best performance lists. Sometimes it's the person who has the most preservance against difficult conditions. We could also had Aething Mu and Keely Hodgkin's 800 meter final. However, I decided to only have one person and that would probably have to kick out Keely Hodgkinson in that. Coach of the year goes to the elderly water boy bottle klaus well i think this just pretty much explains it from this video here if you hope you guys have a really good and happy new year and a really good merry christmas if you want to know what the best field performances are 2023 click on the end screen there. If you want to know what the best track performance is last year, click on the other end screen. I'm Adam McCarthy and I will see you in the next one. Bye.